We've been using Protected Urea now for two seasons at this stage. Farming here in Skelkosh Dean, it's a family farm in the family now, a few generations. Uh, there's 56 adjusted hectares on the, on the block. I, I came home from Kilalton in the late 80s and uh, basically took over in, in 98 where we were milking about 24 cows with sheep and cattle and tillage and different bits. And today we've grown to 317 cows and we're farming approximately 171 hectares of which the balance in between is, is rented, leased land. The plan is uh, we wouldn't be fully stocked on the milking platform yet. We'll, we'll probably go to somewhere around three and a quarter cows a hectare, depending on grass utilisation, grass growing. Uh, you know, so there, there's still a small bit of headroom in terms of cow numbers. Um, that there's extra bit of ground needed for, for heifers and to keep the overall stock rate somewhere around the old cow to the acre, the, the two and a half cows a hectare. I, I don't, we'd be a farm that would suffer from summer dry, and any time we've gone past that line, it has bitten us at some point in time. What we want out of the programme here is, is basically to, to keep going as we're going, uh, to grow more grass, to get more output per cow and per, per unit of, of acre, hectare. Uh, we also want to do it all in a very sustainable, environmentally sound way, a way that will enhance our reputation as farmers and ultimately make sure that we leave the environment in a better place when we're finished our careers as, as farmers and, and move on and hand on to the next generation that we've done a good piece for that. We've been using protected urea now for two seasons at this stage. We've been using trailing chew or low emission uh, methods for probably five years at this stage and again the same thing we'll continue to use that going forward. The labour at the moment here on farm is, is myself and another guy full-time David um, but then we'd say we also keep students and a bit of part-time work and also my father is still active and a young lad Dara coming through. I suppose in relation to the environment here on farm too, one of the big things is biodiversity. Uh, like we, we have to go back and measure, like over the years we have taken out hedges, put back in hedges, but we have to actually physically measure what's there at the moment. Um, we also have a good bit of forestry. Mm -hmm.